So today guys, I will guide you on how to get what's literally a killer sex toy weapon and it is hilarious. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and if you enjoyed this video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So this weapon you can grab at one point in this game and that is it. If you don't do it at this precise moment in time, you can't go back and get it. And you get it right after the Meredith start sex scene. The weapon is that famous penis on a bat we heard about before this game's release and it's called the Sir John Felustif. Now I will first up apologise for not directly showing the weapon as I don't really want to get into trouble with YouTube but what can I say, it's basically a penis on a bat, it vibrates and vibrates even harder upon hitting someone with it. Now Meredith Stout is a corporal agent you do meet really early on in the game. And she is one of a few other NPCs in this game you can trigger a sex scene with. This is a one time thing by the way and you can't form any kind of relationship with her like you can with Judy and Panam. And although if you do look online, every other guide I've saw said you can only do this as a male. This I can confirm is utterly false as my character who I triggered the sex scene with is a female in every single way. So during the mission of the ride with Dexter you get talking about a spider bot. He then informs you of Meredith's stout and she's added to your contacts. Now upon finishing this ride mission you need to call Meredith straight away. So pull up your phone and call her. A few dialogue options will pop up people but you need to select meet up and cut a deal. Stout here. Start by telling me how you got this number. No more than your number. Heard you misplaced a convoy. You shut him up. Spill what you know. Don't make me wait. No, not on the horn. Let's meet. Cut a deal. A deal. Fine. Then go ahead and meet her straight away. Now to trigger the one night stand where you get this weapon from, you need to follow the dialogue options I select on screen now. So as these come along people, select them. Meredith Stout, take it you were the one to call? That'd be me. Thought you could blackmail me, bitch? Set conditions? Got any more for me? Calm the fuck down! I just wanna talk. Shut your trap! That fucking thing ready? All set. Now answer my questions. Honestly. Forthrightly. Are you here alone? Yep. <clears throat> Just little old me. It's the truth. Do a sweep now. contact? Is he the one who leaked intel on the convoy? That guy? Never seen him before. Checks out. Listen, I know where the transport is. I can help you. Just want a favor in return. <sighs> I told you! I fucking told you! I'm not the mole! Jesus Christ! Shut him up! Unhand me now before I... <sighs> Her, you can let go. I want to hear what she has to say. I need a bot. Flathead model. Guys who ripped you off have it. Promise me that bot. I'll point the finger. You have a plan how to deal with them? Could just take it by force, but they're expecting payment, so I could go that route too. Fine, the latter. But on one condition. You pay with our money. Sounds solid enough. Amen. Once you are done here, you can continue on to meet Jackie and the Maelstrom Gang. Here you need to do certain things as well when talking to that Maelstrom Gang and Royce, as you can see on the screen now. You need to select the following. So Dex already paid the male strummers for the corpo bot. Thing is, uh, well, shit goes for you too. 
I'll stand. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. Sit your ass Jack, down for- sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well, all right. Come on. Gotta lighten up. Take a hit. Thanks, I'm good. Whatever you say, strange princess. Here we go. Flathead. Model MT0 D12. Need to see it. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Rafe controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated link too. So when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm -hmm. Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Three. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a cred. Brick got it. It's all paid out. Brick got it. Uh, I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. You can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice, because I say you'll pay twice. Alright, you want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. Uh... You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshaun. That's who. Dexter Deshaun. The hard ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? Maybe <laughs> <laughs> dead? Nope. He's alive, well, and kicking. He sends his regards. So I'm gonna consider my offer now. Bang. Once you are done here guys, you can continue on and end the mission and you are met by Meredith Stout. When she asks if you want to work with her again, you need to select yes, maybe. And then some considerable time later people, for me it was literally during a mission 7 main story missions later called Disaster Peace, I received a text message from her stating, Militech played out as I hoped, thank you and remember, we don't know each other. You need to reply with shame, I was starting to like you. She will reply with, no town motel, first floor come alone. You then need to reply with, I'll be there. Then guys, all you need to do is head over by going into your journal and triggering the mission Venus in Furs. This will send you straight to no town motel. Then guys, all you have to do is head over and you'll trigger that Meredith Stout sex scene. In my case, it was a lesbian sex scene. And when this sex scene is finished, people, you can go ahead and grab this weapon off the bed and, well, have fun with it. Again, apologies for not actually showing off the weapon. Like I said, I don't want to get into trouble with YouTube. But yes, I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you enjoyed this killer sex toy weapon. It is absolutely hilarious. I mean, it vibrates. If you swing it, it vibrates even louder. I mean, what more do you need? But on that note guys, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more Cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video or upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.